This is to Sega of America, Japan, and Europe. This is the idea that y'all need to bring out. They need to bring out a Sega Saturn, Sega CD, 32X CD, and Sega Dreamcast Mini system, but put them all together in one WAP. So, you know what I'm saying? Pick like 20 games from the Saturn, 20 games from the Sega, and 20 games from the uh, Dreamcast, and throw them in there. And then make it SD backwards compatible, because you already know the bootleggers out here already and then hack your shit and did what they do. So make it easier for us people, you know what I'm saying? Put that emulation or whatever on there and, and help us people that like 32X CD. Sega. And, and make it and make it to where you can SD the situation to where we can hack it and put other Sega Sega stuff on it. Or make it all Sega. Make it all Sega. And then create an expansion port to where it's like a it's like a uh, what do you call those those little micro sd readers make it one of those but make it a reader plus it reads card games it reads the cartridges you know what i'm saying and that way it's like shit everybody can and now and, 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 and if you want to it can read cds but mainly just read the cartridges make it compatible like that make an all sega system you'll make a killing if you make an all sega system That'll be your big biggest sale. They'll be like, ooh, they brought out a, a whole nother system. A whole nother system is not new, it's just the old system, just playing all the old games. Including the burnt games. Cause you know they out there, they exist. So why fight the feeling? You know, why fight the feeling? Make an all Sega system? That would be nice. But y'all ain't gonna listen to our Sega of America, Europe, and Japan. Y'all not gonna listen. Cause y'all stubborn headed, that's why y'all don't have uh, y'all ain't in competition with the, with the uh, companies no more. Y'all just make games. And all them games y'all made, you could have put them out on your systems. Remastered them, HD'd them, and put them on the systems. And watch, all them games y'all would have did. And then still keep it exclusive with the companies too. Like, hey, you know, still keep it exclusive. You would make a lot of money like that. See, that's what's wrong with these companies now. Y'all need to come together and just say, you know what? What Nintendo has, PlayStation has. And what PlayStation has, Xbox has. What Xbox has. Sega has, you feel what I'm saying? And all y'all together, just, hey, it's not not as one, but it's like saying, hey, you can get it on the Xbox, it might have this extra in it, but you get it on, on PlayStation, it has this extra in it, or you get it on, you know what I'm saying? Like how they did with the, with the Soul Calibur games. It was like, okay, we made one where on the GameCube, the character was Link's as unlockable, then on, on, the, uh, on the Xbox, it was Spawn. You know what I'm saying? When they made the Soul Calibur 2. And then on the uh, other one, it was, which they had a Tekken character in there anyway. So, they should have just went ahead and just, you know what I'm saying? Like, how they did that. Same with Nintendo. When they be making their games, they NBA Streets and all that. They added their own characters in there too as well. So, make a game like that. Make it like that. You know what I'm saying? And then... And then you know what I'm saying, and then plus you fighting companies like 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 so if they bring out a Soul Calibur for uh bring out a new Soul Calibur for the Nintendo, whether it be the Switch, Wii U, or the Wii, whatever. Even though they don't they they, they ain't making games for it, but still, to you indie companies, keep making games for these other companies. Keep making games for these old systems. We want to see games come out for the old systems too as well, so we can go in and buy them, resurrect the old systems back. When you resurrect them. It's going to make it perfect. You don't resurrect them, guess what? But it'd be good to resurrect them to where y'all back in the forefront making games for them and people can go buy them in the stores. That's what you indie companies need to do. Resurrect all the old systems. So we won't have to go to GameCon and be digging up old games. We can just walk up and say like a GameStop or one of these electronic stores that sell game systems. And over here is a, is a section of Sega Genesis cartridges, a section of Sega Master System cartridges, a section of, you know, resurrect the stuff back. That's what they need to do. They need to resurrect it back. Resurrect that stuff and bring it back out and watch how many people go out and start buying it. You resurrect the old system to bring like bring back out a Super Nintendo instead of it being a mini, be the regular Super Nintendo and say new games coming soon. Niggas going to be like, you know how many motherfuckers are going to go buy Super Nintendo just because they got new games coming in soon? And make that motherfucker 
you know, region free. So you can play the Europe versions and you can play fucking Super Fabcom, Fabicom games. And they be in the stores. And then it says new games coming soon. New games coming soon. Do you know how much money they'll make off of that? New games coming soon? And this, But this mainly story, this mainly situation is to Sega of America. Just come on, man. We need another game system. If y'all not going to come out with a new one, at least make the the, 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 the all Sega system. Where it's just everything that y'all ever brought out, Sega orientated, will be on that system. As far as like... You know, you bring out the system, all all the CD-based games are compatible on it. You can play all card games. You can play SD card games, you know, if that's on the SD card. You can play games on a hard drive. All the, Make it to where it's all formatable ways to play it, to play your games. Even CD part. Watch how much money y'all make off that shit. I'm telling you. I'm not trying to cuss, but watch how much money y'all make off of it. Y'all will make a lot of money off of that system. And then say new games coming soon, meaning like we got indie companies that want to make games for the system. Where now they're licensed, where it's like, hey, this is owned by Sega. We license this. And this. You know how much money y'all would make? That all the indie companies rebring games out and ask some of the uh, companies that did bring games out for it. Hey, we need you to bring some more games out if you can. Watch how much money you make off of that. But y'all see what it is. I want to make a part two to this. Cali, Texas, ENT.